Hey, so we are now loading in to the Nautiloid. I am, uh, I have a autosave created here. The first time you come in, you your autosave, if you follow the settings, will create a save at the start of this cutscene, which is the start of the run. Uh, and it is valid to just quick load this cutscene in order to try again without having to recreate Gale. Uh, for that, you just go in here, turn off autosave from this point on, and then reload, and now you're good to go. For the first part of the run, we are escaping the Nautiloid. Uh, the only major trick here will be a jump through a wall in the second room. But for now, just enhance sleep on yourself and head for the door. At this point, we're going to come into this little cubby here. I recommend entering tactical mode because you need it for this next trick. We're going to put dash on ourselves and then jump slightly to the bottom right of this light source with a jump and mouse scroll interact, uh, which will jump us into the wall about here where my mouse is. Then we'll do a second jump and mouse scroll onto the platform. And then before the cutscene begins, we need to hit shift space to enter turn-based mode in order to preserve our dash. It may take a couple tries. Uh, I will cut ahead to what it looks like when it succeeds. So that was successful. As you can see, I still have dash movement and I have my bonus action and action refunded. I can now do another dash to increase my movement. Move just about here. And then from there, we will jump to the transponder. Get this cutscene, activate the transponder, and that's the Nautiloid. Now I'll, I'll show a faster version of what it should look like 